Oh, welcome back to Aldridge Farm. First thing to say, I'm keyboarding this today. I seem to damage my shoulder a bit. And getting the wheel into places. <laughs> Not so no fancy doing. So uh, you have to put me uh, on the keyboard. It should be a laugh. No, we're doing the spuds. We got the beat in. I had to call on Chris to give me a hand in the end. Uh, couldn't do it on my own. I got him uh, on the beat halves and I was running away. It, it worked quite well. And halfway through we swapped over. Right, we're on the potatoes now. We'll get these done out of the way today. Just hired the lift up. I've been top, so there's no need for that. As you can see, they're coming up quite nicely. Uh, I would have loved to have the self drive, but cost was a, is a, actually against us for that. It's just too expensive. No, I'm not even certain if I'm getting these right. Oh, we don't look too bad there. Looks so if we just keep the wheel just off the half of the area, we shan't be too far out. Let's have a look out top. I oh, we can go in. Oh, that's better. Oh, this should be fun. We've got a tree to come past. So I'm going to have to... Oh, didn't go far, far enough out. Yeah, we've got it this time. We probably have to miss that unless we could just reverse and uh, you know, come around the opposite way to get that bit. Just, just um, try and get one to cruise control. Oh, hold on! It should be on. It should be on there. No. Oh well, cruise doesn't want to work for some reason. Could be this tractor, or something I'm doing wrong. Never mind. We don't worry about crews. We just go around, get a couple of headlands done, and we should be okay. I'm not going to worry about getting both fields done today. We just get this one out of the way. Do the other one. Uh, uh, on Monday, just it's Sunday today. It's a day of rest. They tell me. Are oh, they kidding? Uh, somehow we missed. Don't want to leave too many of these in the ground. The first load going to the pub, to George and his uh, potato business, and from then on everything goes down to the uh, train, where they will all be going out to get maximum money for them. No, no sign of Tom yet. No word from. Him. But there's one thing I have noticed that the, there's been less uh, vandalism or industrial sabotage or, or whatever you want to call it up at the uh, solar plant. No idea why, but uh, well, I'm hoping it's to do with Tom. I'm hoping he's actually got so, he's getting some sorted because that seems to be why he went. His uh, partner hasn't heard anything from him either. I did ask her. She's a little bit concerned that he's away. Now let's just try and get this little bit of hair, and then we've got to follow out. And hopefully, Miss and uh, Miss, uh, I really want to straighten this edge up a bit. I want to straighten it all up, but there, kind of everything. We do have a two load, I think, two fields of this going around this way then we start doing some up and down work and you might notice we've got plenty we've got quite a bit of money now we've got uh, over a hundred thousand we had about 110 thousand after we sold everything off paid chris a little bit uh, yeah it's, it's for his time you have to he didn't want it but uh, he spent near the all day helping out on the beat and I think it's only fair he should get something for it. He just does like to help, I will say that for him. Very helpful chap. And I will be using him again. I think uh, once we've got this done, I'm going to ask him if he fancy a little bit of ploughing in his spare time. No hurry for it, any time before the spring. 
and that's at field 19 uh, save the one with the beak on it that will definitely have to be played after beak's been in there and of course the uh, I'm hoping to get enough money together so we can actually buy a self propelled beat harvester of our own I fancy the homer but I think that's going to be far too much we might probably end up with a grimmy I'd say end up with a grimmy a grimmy is a great tool but the homer is the bee's knees at the moment now I want to try and do it so we don't go out into the field here, even me missing some. Just hope we can miss that. Uh, yep, we missed the tree, I think. Yep, that's fine. We should be straighten this out properly now. How are we doing? 96, oh, we're almost full. I want to stop here somewhere. Where we can actually uh, get the track and trailer alongside. There goes a save. This uh, system's getting rather old now. The uh, <laughs> to come out of character for one moment. I want to stop there. I think. <clears throat> uh, yes, I'm saying this is this game's getting a little bit old now, and it, it's getting a little bit um, temperamental, shall we say. Oh, I'm going to come out of cab to do it. For start, I wasn't certain whether I'd, and I hadn't, whether I'd actually open the top up right. We'll go round, I'll get in the cab until we get round. I've been thinking I might finish the old Ridge series off completely once 19th launches. We will have done somewhere around 600 odd hours on this one map by then. I think it's most probably enough. I can find other things, new things on. Uh, hang on, I better get the pipe boat too. I ain't got the pipe boat. Yeah. That won't do. At least I don't think I've got the pipe boat. I need to have a look, see what's what on this. Don't use these very often. Let's have a look. Oh, pipe boat. Oh, that's better. I can get rid of that. No. Come out of there. Yeah, Chad done as well. A brand new one, this. I think he's trying to sell it to us. Here, yeah, have a... Here, yeah, have a hope. We haven't got the money to buy that. I'm going to come out of the cab, because I'm... I don't know if we're in close enough, or if this is one of those ones where we have to... We'll, I'll have to s start it from inside now, there it goes, we got it this time. I'll shut that off again, get back there, one ready to go as soon as uh, we're loaded. So the first lorry load, or <laughs> lorry load, first trailer load over to the pub, then the rest down to the train station. That's it. We're away again. I think we might better start going up and down. No, we've just got to figure out which is the longest edge. I think the edge with the tree is probably the longest. It would be. It's going to be the most awkward to do. As I'm recording this, uh, World Cup is in full flow. I'm recording the day before England's second match in the World Cup, so I've got no idea how they will get on. Keep my fingers crossed anyway. Fingers, toes, and everything else. I want to check that. Hmm. Yeah, now, sorry, just check and see what was what there. Oh no. We're going to miss some spuds, we always do, and we will have to plow these two up. Uh, more. Plow then, I think I will do the same as I've got Chris doing on the 11. Every so often go over and just riffle it up. So 
Let's look at the furloughs around here. We should be alright. I think I better do another full tank of uh, potatoes before we get stuck on up and down. Just to give us enough room. See, I'll rent this for for around six hours. Uh, should be plenty of time to do this field. And I reckon next time you're there, we'll do the other field. That's if we get this one done. What I don't do on this one today, I'll do it off, off screen. One of the problems with this is the gain out of characters. You can't use uh, auto combine on these type of things. It doesn't like them. On these uh, pulled ones with a tractor, self-drive, no problem. These ones doesn't like them at all. And I could bring course play in. In fact, with ten Chris's there, I could do quite easily, but. Uh, it misses even more than I do. And that's saying something. Yeah, I think we've just about got to the end of Old Ridge now. I've been thinking about it sometime. I know I said I would not drop it, but it's got harder since I haven't got my uh, sparring buddy uh, by Pool of Profit making videos anymore. So rather than uh, carry out this boy, I'm not even certain how I'd use uh, GPS on this actually because of the offset. That's the one thing you can't, with this you definitely cannot top and uh, lift at the same time. Well, I'm just going down here and I'm going to turn around. Mind you, if we turn around we're going to squash the, the spuds. So we've got to keep going round and round. Or we go up and up one side, cut across and go down the other. How are we doing on? Oh, 62, sorry, 63%. We're getting another lap out of this yet. Trying to play slightly realistic. I wouldn't want to drive over the crop. Normally, you'd give a lot bigger he uh, dead land around the potato fields to drive on for a start of. But I want to get full value for it. I'm going to go out and turn around here. Let's just lift this. Try not to go too much on that. I'm going to pick it up again about here. These are very funny shaped fields. As, as you well know, you've seen these fields often enough. This is all organic potatoes. As you can see, there's plenty of weed in, but uh, it's the one thing you do get if you go organic, you will get a lot of weeds. Luckily, the disease hasn't been a problem. How are we doing now? We're 88, yeah, I think we're, I think we're fill again. We're offload again when we get round here. Just get ahead of him and then I can hopefully drive on to get onto that next try. Oh, look at that, we missed a whole load out there. I think we might have had that. Start turning around now. We might just have enough space. What are we doing on? 97. Oh, we will. We will go the full Monty, so to speak. We'll try and turn. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Back up. Back up. Sit. Lovely piece of kit, all this. It really is well made. <sighs> Did think about getting one of those uh, from the uh, 
vehicle collector, you may remember that uh, BP used some of this stuff. I did think about getting one of his uh, self-drive old Russian bits of kit. But then thought, no. The last thing I want is that breaking down in the field. Be quicker in, in some respects. That no, so we got it here. Are we filling the boat? No, we missed it again. We're too far out again. Ah, oh, got it this time. Do the same again. Switch off and then change over again. Should I get one more load in there, I think. Switch it on, ready. Make certain it's down, and uh, what I think I'll do, I'll do one load to George, then we take the next load uh, to the uh, train station. Right, I'm gonna. I'm actually gonna try and cut some of this down. No, no, this might be actually the one to go. We'll go here. Hmm. So we've got our two longer straights or straight edges together. Doesn't help. <laughs> so I don't want to uh, drive over the crop. Now they will survive slightly better than the uh, than grain will, but uh, even so, well, it hasn't been a bad harvest actually. We've done quite nicely out of this. What else has been going on? Oh, yeah, well, mother-in-law, of course, is rather excited about uh, a new version of farming sim. I don't know. I can't get her out onto the farm. <laughs> but she'll play it on that computer for hours at a time. Amazing, really. And she's got me here so we've got this uh, net uh, network of farmers all online and she does it for me she fills in my details for them i don't know why she all right let's see if we can turn this here I'm trying to get this straight up this edge we'll cut this bit off anyway for a start off And we've been, as you know, we've been sending stuff or talking to Chad and Chad sent that uh, front loader off and they have received it in America in the Adams County Museum based on this particular farm. I, I can't remember the uh, guy who started ever coming here, but apparently he did. He may not have stayed on this particular farm. He might have just walked around and uh, looked at it and... Uh, said that's the one for me when I start a museum up but apparently he's got a very close record there's been some post posted pictures uh, pictures posted on the internet of it and it looks very close to this place uh, posted by, by Darren Castle I think his name is uh, got something to do with the uh, area I think he owns a uh, Fertiliser specialist uh, place hires out the equipment and uh, contracts fertilisation, doing fertilising for the uh, local farms. And I think he actually was the one who persuaded the farmer that uh, to give him the land, and the farmer took it over and just ran with it so to speak 
I'll begin to sound just just like a modern youth, all this sort of speak, and the, all I've got to do now is start saying like every second word. How are we doing now? We've got 71. Oh, we're getting through this field. Oh, these aren't, shouldn't take long. I think we're high for a we we'll see how long this one takes, and we're half or roughly the same as the time for the second field. We all need to take this back and, and wash it before we take it back, because uh, we're going to lose money with it being dirty. I'd hate to do this on a big field. Uh, Boy, would I hate to have to do this on a big field. How are we doing there? We're at 84%. Uh, Crawford Brown's been quiet-ish again. Just our normal rubbish. Uh, a local haulier has uh, threatened to park uh, outside the house, park his lorry outside the house. Oh, outside Tom's house and to protect that. Get, get the story right. But as I said, it would be a bit stupid because I go tearing around that road quite often where Tom lives, and uh, I'd forget that Stu's truck is parked there. But we are all keeping an eye open, especially for Tom's uh, better half. All right, that should do. Well, I thought that's for. We'll turn that off now because it's going to be. I'm going to have to run this lot away in the right side of the dusty thing. Just back up a bit. So we stand a chance of getting under this. You have to get in fairly close. I already learned on these things. Oh my god. Oh, we had it. We had seven. Well, work. oh, perhaps that will count as full as 99%. Oh no, that's the wrong one. Oh, perhaps we ain't quite close enough yet. Oh, we got it this time. First load of potatoes gone away. <laughs> That's it. Get the sheet on. Just check the Get the sheet on us on. Oh, I'm trying to get out of here now. It's easier said than done. And off to the pub. And I'll try not to have too much to drink whilst I'm there. And we might start on the second load, and that will be it for the day. So a grand little community. We're, we're amazed we've still got all the things we've got here. Like we've still got a shop and a post office. Or two shops if you count Darren's. We've got a pub and a hotel. That's not that many villages, so what I've got that a lot. Try not to Knock any Sunday afternoon drinkers over. They don't seem to like it too much. Oh, yeah. Oh, I've got that uh, bug again with the uh, brake sound. I have to have a. One of these days I will look up these things and get them right there. Five phones and he's paid me. Check the. Trailer's gone to God, that water wash. Look at the state of that. Something won't wash before we start moving any grain with it. But it's nice now we've got 
the harvest is just put all in the last couple of fields to do and um, well you can say we're done we're done for another year Oh, I didn't say that a couple of the uh, fans have been caught. <sighs> oh, they seem to be quite minor characters. Very much a couple of likely, local likely lads who was given a bit of money to go up there and smash things up. Well, at least we now know some of the names behind it. Not that it helps us a lot. But just empty this right out, I suppose. If we can get under close enough. But of course, Crawford Browns want amongst the names. We can't write that out there. That won't be out there. Start all this up again and uh, away we go. So quick, let's have a look outside see how this thing works. So it digs into the potatoes, lifts them up, it cleans them, and you see the muck coming out the bottom there. Puts them in a the little hopper. <laughs> From the hopper, of course, they then go up, up, up and away onto the trail. All right, but lift that up. And already, the only difference between this and the uh, self draw or this, the self propelled is that they have self propelled, and I think they've got a slightly wider lift and blade on them. This only takes a couple of rolls at a time. Right, back in cab, back where I'm happiest. Yes, uh, yes, I think it's time I retired. We've got uh, everything just about sorted out now, except the Crawford Browns, which we need to get rid of somehow. But I think it might be time to start another long running series when 19 starts, pick the right map. It won't be newbie, because I've already decided I'm playing newbie. I don't know what else is coming out, whether Johnny is bringing the or Johnny's bound to bring a map out. I hope uh, Mick, uh, so old ball, brings another version of Blickling out. If he does, I think I might use that. It's, I can use more of my local knowledge on that. One thing you find about a lot, a lot of YouTubers, we're always thinking about what we're going to do in the future. And we're never satisfied with what, with what we've already done. I, I know every time I've, I post a video, I know I could have done better. <sighs> Man, in the drive, no, come to think of it, in the drive, I could never do better than I already do. That's all you're going to get. I'm not going to improve from that. <sighs> but if I bring in a new long running soap opera, which I intend to, which may well last. Uh, 19 and, and 21, Farmer Sims 1921. I will do the sounds I've done here. I will bring subscribers who want their name associated with it into it as a character. I won't be doing multiplayer. I'm, I don't know what it is. It's something about me actually on multiplayer and Farmer Sims. I prefer doing things my way. Oh, turn the wrong way, didn't I? <laughs> Never mind. Well, we've got the fair amount of this done now. 
We're doing very well indeed, I think, on this. We've got... I think we've got a quarter of it done anyway. And I will finish this up off-screen. And we should make a pretty penny when we do it. And we will do the other field next time. And I might actually bring in a um a, a lifter self-propelled lifter for that uh, vintage piece of Russian kit I think we might just do that if we do I might probably get the little multi uh, well I won't need this tractor there but just uh, try and persuade Chris to start playing 19 Yeah, you know, he seems very keen to help. And by the way, if I do start a new one, Chris will certainly be a character. As will Darren and Stu. I haven't heard from Chad for a long time, so it looks like he's uh, no longer able to communicate. I know he was busy last time I heard from him. Oh, we're doing anyway. Oh, we're up to 89. Well, I'll do as I tell you. I'll start me winding down now. I think I'm going to say thank you very much for watching. If you like what you saw, please consider leaving a like. If you're not subscribed and wish to subscribe, feel free to do so. And a little extra, if you want to be a character on the next series, let me know in the comments below. I will include you. I will, unless you really want to be, you won't be a bad guy. You. Might be like Stu a little bit scatty or very helpful like Chris and Darren. I'll uh, try not to make you seem a fool, even though you might think you are, hello. Just fill build up again. I think we're there. <laughs> um, any comments, questions, queries, feel free to post them in the comment section. I think we go around the field a bit quicker. Believe it or not, I think it will be quicker. But we can see how much we've got left, and there ain't a lot left now. Don't ask me why I stopped there, I just uh, had a cough coming on, I managed to suppress it. And what that is, man, and Santa, cheerio for now, cheerio and happy farming.